So all these plants, though they are of the same species, are completely different from each other. That's right! These are all frogs of the same family in terms of species, but they are all somehow different. Look at the patterns on their backs, each slightly different from each other. Uh huh. But what causes that to happen? I wonder too. It's just like the leaves Tabasamu showed us in class. They had different vein structures, even though they came from the same tree. These frogs have different back patterns, even though they have the same parents. So is that what happened with you too, Tabasamu? Even though you have the same parents as your sisters, they are able to hear but you can't? How does that even happen? Well, as Ms. Malota said, I guess since we inherit genes from our parents, so if we have the same parents, then we can have similarities and also differences depending on what we inherit from each parent. It could be. So does it mean everything that is different from our brothers and sisters is something that we might have inherited but they haven't? But what about things that are different from us, but none of our parents have it? For example, I love sleeping for long hours, but no one in my family does. Where did I get that from? <laughs> Ooh, wow, I didn't know that, Tabasamo. So you're saying that there's a difference between inherited genes and your own character traits. Your character traits are just random behaviors you have that have nothing to do with your genes, like sleeping long hours or having a favorite color. But your inherited genes are what determine things like your eye color or your hair color and texture like Mamandega's cheeks who have inherited the same genes and have the same feather colors. Do you think the environment can have any effect on the differences? Gadere once told me that he had trouble with his bean seedlings growing because he wasn't providing them with the right environment to grow. Those that didn't grow became brown and small, and those that did grow became green and big. What do you think? Oh yeah, I remember that because we tried to grow the beans together. I don't know if that has anything to do with biological variation though, so I'm not sure, Baraka. The interesting thing is that no matter how different we are, and what causes those differences, we can always find something to tie us together in one nest. Right, Tabasamu? That's right! Utu! You're catching on fast, Tabasamu. I can't wait for you to come join the Utu Club. Me too! Back to our question about if the environment can have an effect on how something or someone grows. Let's do an experiment to find the answer. Let's each take a pea pod from here. Each one has four seeds in it, right? So let's each take our four seeds home and plant it in different types and qualities of soil we each have at home. Then let's see how each seed will grow separately in our completely different environments. Great idea! And that way we can find out if the environment affects biological variation or not. Tabasamu, we need to introduce you to Mzekigo. He's a great farmer and can share with us some farming tips so that we can each know how to care for our flower seeds. What do you think? So as long as you do that, your plants should grow happy and healthy. Thanks Mzekigo. And how long will they take to grow fully? Mm, two months should do it. What? Two months? That's like forever! Aren't there any other plants you can plant that take a shorter time than that? Well, not much shorter. You need patience when it comes to planting and farming, Baraka. Growing something takes time. Heh. <laughs> Another lesson on patience again. Let's just work with these seeds we've got, Baraka. We've already traveled with them from the forest to here. I'm sure they're already excited to get to each of their new homes. Look, Tabasamo has already bonded with hers. Okay, let's do this. Ooh, be a little patient. Time. 
Patience is a part of Utu. Some things need time. Some things take time. Some things need time. Like this video and want to watch more? Yay! Subscribe to get exclusive access to premium content and more. Only in the Bongo Playroom. Free for download today. The only place you can watch, sing, read, play, and learn with all your favorite Obongo characters. What are you waiting for? Available in English, Kiswahili, French, Hausa, and more.